welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Lacey and I have got a short video clip for you guys of a coyote hunt that I did. Uh, this is from back at the very end of January, so like a month and a half ago. And uh, I was coyote hunting with my friend Lewis. I just kind of wanted to explain just real briefly. I'm on a walk right now, actually. And it's really slippery, but it's really beautiful too. So, if I start to slide around... <laughs> oh my gosh, that's why! <clears throat> so yeah, don't record YouTube videos, you guys, while you're walking down a hill in the ice in, in rubber boots. <laughs> but anyway, so... So, as I was saying, uh, I recorded a video for you guys of a coyote hunt with my friend Lewis, and it was my first coyote hunt that I've ever gone on with him. Um, he has done this a lot. He's really good at it. Um, he gets a ton of coyotes. I was able to shoot a coyote, and I was able to record it. Uh, before I got there, though, I was not planning on recording any of it because... I didn't really know how how are you supposed to record hunting in the middle of the night in the dark without like shining lights all over everything and totally giving yourself away so wasn't really sure how to go about doing that but we did figure it out so I got the video for you guys and gonna be posting it here next the the gist of it though um, just in case you want to know kind of what's going on out there he has got this thermal monoscope that he looks through and he scans all over with that in the dark and he looks for any sign of heat and that's kind of how we find the coyotes and I stand there the whole time uh, in front of a tripod with an AR-15 and just wait for him to see a coyote. I find it and then if I can find it I try to get as clean and quick of a shot on it as I can so that's kind of how that works so here's the video guys I hope you enjoy it so this is my friend Lewis we are heading out coyote hunting we're in central Minnesota we're gonna head out to a couple spots and hopefully we'll see some yeah I'll be running the, the thermal monocular and then she'll be on the AR with the night vision scope so we're just heading out now and uh, it's about 9 o'clock, got one spot we're going to go to till 10 and then we've got a couple more after that. Oh. Well, now you see where it came out. That's like perfect. Yeah, he was probably a pup last year. Let me get this cluster out of here. I kind of knotted that up pretty good, yeah, didn't what I? Are you doing? <laughs> kind of braid it. I kind of rolled it into a ball because I didn't want to trip on it. A little pass kill blood action on there. Yeah, 
Yeah. I'll show you. Like this around the head. Take them for a walk. Okay. So yeah, throw that around. Whatever side you want. What do you think, Lacey? I'm still surprised that I actually shot one my first time. That monocular was awesome though that you spotted it right away. I would never have seen it that fast. So Lewis is gonna get us set up here for a quick picture. I'm gonna grab my call so I don't forget it. It's kind of a is it that's a littler one kind of right? So you said this is a normal size? Yeah, he's He's normal. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful, not even, not really rubbed, nothing. Beautiful male. Yeah, his coat's awesome. I love it. A little of the tan, typical Minnesota, more red. He's got a little bit of the darker white coloration, which is pretty cool. Yeah, he's definitely redder than I was expecting, that's for sure. Yes, he is. Definitely not a pup, a little plaque in there, but definitely a deer killer. Let's pick up all four legs. for the night and we just got the one coyote my first ever coyote so 
um, heading out now, but I just wanted to say I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video, and I'm going to have some more up for you soon, and don't forget to give my video a like, and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time.